Welcome guys um, to a short video of Max after a long time um, Yeah, or after quite some time I I had an interesting battle in arena and uh, I think I can demonstrate to some tactics here for battles in arena um, Yeah, my reward time was about 10 minutes ago, so I tried to advance a little bit further in arena I'm usually defending with uh, putting in Marta here um, now because my reward time is over now I will uh, be beaten and then fall back again but when I, my reward time is uh, is uh, coming then I will always put in Chet so my A team but now I'm back to Marta uh, yeah so uh, before I fought my way um, to the front I was uh, thrown back at rank 114 and then I managed to beat Ryan and um, yeah and then this second battle this uh, fight against Parsa I, I want to show you he has a, a scary team really you will see when we start a battle he has a good tank I think he used Cleaver and then he's using Kark a very developed Kark and right behind him Kira and so then you might think, oh my god, as if one of them is not enough in a lineup, is not bad enough, he's using both of them, Kark and Kira. But here I thought, mm, I might have a chance, not by going with my standard team, with, uh, with Fox, but when switching in Jorgen. I don't have uh, that strong Jorgen, but then uh, I made up my mind to go with this lineup, because... Um, yeah, it's actually not good having Kira and Kark in your lineup. It can work when you have yeah more power, but you might run into problems or one can't take advantage of this. Because my thinking was his Kira is very strong, is stronger than my Kira, so she will be likely to um, to get through with her uh, basic attacks, uh, her. Uh, ricocheting dagger she will get through to Jorgen and then Jorgen will load up his energy bar first before Kark can use his first skill then Jorgen will use his ultimate and then hinder his Kark from using his ultimate and so I thought there might be a chance that I beat him and uh, we will see in a moment what happened So you see he has really very strong heroes, this is a, a good cleaver and also his Kira is very strong but as predicted now my Jorgen used his first skill, now Kark cannot use his, uh, his most powerful weapon, his first skill and now my Kira is not that bad either and she's taking care of everyone now before, before Kark can use his ultimate so and yeah and that was it. <laughs> and yeah, it, one has to try the scary. His total power is 520 kilo, but uh, yeah, it uh, turned out the mechanics uh, of him using two superstars, Kira and Kark, they don't have a, a great synergy. And uh, yeah, they have some synergy, but yeah, not in this battle. So I just wanted to show you this. Um, then yeah, I, also against Madeo, I have an interesting lineup here. I don't know why, but when I using when I'm using Chet against him, then I seem to lose. <laughs> but when I bring in Marta, then it's a win. But don't ask me why. It's uh, very hard to say. Some timing that is a little bit different, and then. It turns out that his Kira will fall and yeah, it's usually like this. Now he has a very resilient lineup. He's using Oliver and also Marta and Andwari, a very tough crowd to pass. But for this, my lineup with Fox is really ideal. They can develop an enormous amount of, uh, of damage dealing and uh, eventually, uh, yeah. No defense can resist when when they are not somehow attacked uh, and uh, they can develop their full potential together with Nebula 
then yeah, I just uh, go through can cause uh, almost any defensive lineup. This last hit was nice, 145 kilo critical hit. I don't know, I haven't seen. Was it by Fox or by uh, or by Kira? But yeah, it's really nice to see this this uh, huge amount of damage dealing. I really think uh, the way to play this game is to have an attacking lineup because uh, when you go defensive lineup, uh, yeah, when the other guy has some all-out attacking lineup, then uh, eventually it will crack under pressure. And then the final battle here uh, for going to the top 20 was against Killing Intent. It's about the same powers I have. Here I also went again with uh, with Jorken instead of Fox. And here the good thing is that my Jorken is triggering before his Sebastian and then uh, Sebastian cannot uh, hinder the curse, Jorgen's first skill. And it also has to do with his Kira is loading up my Jorgen faster because my Kira cannot pass to his Sebastian. So once I will have reached level 130, maybe I will lose against his lineup. Yeah, those are these little uh, details that can decide the battle. Who is loading his first skill first, and this can be decisive. And then you get stronger, you develop your heroes, and all of a sudden you lose. Uh, even though, although your heroes uh, have gotten stronger and then you're confused, but you see Majorcan is only 23 kilos, so when he gets hit, he will load up his energy bar very fast. I, I don't know the exact mechanics anymore, but uh, you, uh, the more health you lose, the, the faster your energy bar is loading up. So he is loading up very fast. So. Okay, there is also danger that he dies, and then of course it's all over. But when he's just a little bit weakish and he's not dying, then he's very dangerous because then he's loading up his energy bar before uh, the enemy can load up their energy bar, and uh, then his first skill is really powerful. So Sebastian is the the, the guy who can take care of Jorgen, but only when he can trigger his first skill and uh, when Jorgen is uh, using his first skill first then he's preventing Sebastian from using his first skill and yeah this is nice uh, introduction of Sebastian making the game more interesting maybe the last thing let's have again a look at um, the, the pets here of um, Parsa's lineup is a really powerful lineup Fenris 3 1461 my Fenris has okay also over 3000 but still a bit weaker then he has Mara okay that's a weak Mara for Faceless and a medium strong Oliver for uh, Cleaver so I hope you enjoyed this video um, and uh, yeah I'm sure uh, time and time again if I encounter something interesting like today I will make another video Until then, see you next time. Thanks for watching. This is Max. Bye.